Hey guys! Hello there! I know, it's been more than a week and I said nothing yet, but here I am. Um, I was taking care of some personal stuff, visa, and I wanted to make sure that everything was good before I came here to talk with you guys. So everything's okay and here I am. First of all, I want to say that I'm okay. I'm happy, I'm healthy, and most important, I'm so excited for the future, for real. So, um, as you guys know, I don't work for WWE anymore. Um, I was with the company for two years and a half or so, a little bit more, I guess. Um, and honestly, that was like the most crazy and amazing opportunity of my whole life. I will always be grateful because WWE changed my life and for better. Uh, I came here to US and I had no English. I had no idea what wrestling was before. And after two years, I was in a WrestleMania ring, guys. Do you have any idea? I had just two years of experience and I was in WrestleMania. I was the first Brazilian uh, to be signed with WWE, uh, the first one to step in the WrestleMania ring. So I had so many cool moments and so many good feelings that I'm just grateful. I met so many good people and special that I will have them with me forever, for my whole life. So it was good. Um, but in the last couple months, I was not feeling like that anymore. I was not happy. Um, as you guys know, I have a background in judo. So I'm always competing with myself. And I need to feel that um, I'm growing, that I have space to grow, that I'm useful. You know, and I was not feeling like that anymore. I talked to them, we tried to figure it out and that was just not happy and I am like that. When I'm not happy, I try to change. If I can change, let's go, move on, you know? And then I asked for my release about three months ago um, and they were not able to give it to me by then and I had no option but to try again. <laughs> and then in the middle of the pandemic, I was at home and I got a call. Hey Tay, bye. They released me. Uh, of course it was a shock. I was upset, I was nervous. But you know, now that I figured out everything, I'm happy because I wanted to have good feelings about the debris in my heart and I will always have it. But let's talk about next steps. Um, I felt in love with wrestling. And every time the debris signed someone that came from the Indies or from another company, I always asked questions. I was always trying to understand better. And you know, I, I'm curious. I always need to feel that I have challenge. And I always said, even for the coaches, that I will miss a lot because we had like great coaches in WWE and that I learned a lot from them. Um, I always said that I wanted to, to learn more. I wanted to know about wrestling more because I just know WWE. And wrestling is much bigger than that. And I know this, so I always ask the question that was always was happy to learn more. And here I am, free to know, to you know, to learn. And I really, really want to achieve a couple of dreams, like go to Japan and wrestling in other places. So I'm really excited, excited for the future, guys. I really am. Uh, but for now. That's all. I can't say anything more because I'm not sure about anything yet. But yes, I do have a couple of plans. And yes, I will be in the business. And yes, I will be in US. 
So thank you so much for your support. I do appreciate all the message that I, I got. Um, and I have something really important to tell you guys. I almost forgot. Latinas do it better anywhere. <laughs> See you guys soon. Thank you.